Oh, I'm all right, Bourbon Quest. It's your host, Bourbon Steve. And what do we got today? Oh, we got four bottles that we're doing blind. Uh, so, these are all uh, age stated between 10 and 12 years old, which I kind of think is one of the sweet spots of bourbon um, for age stated stuff is uh, that 10 to 12 year range. Uh, granted, some great things, you know, higher, great things under, but I, I like the 10 to 12 year age statement. And, um, I think it's kind of a sweet spot. So, what are we doing tonight? Well, we got Weller, 12 year old. We got last year's release of Jack Daniels, 10 year old. We got an Elijah Craig Barrel Proof, which is head stated on the side there, 12 years, yeah, 12 years old. And then the uh, Evan Williams, 12 years, which all these I think are pretty, pretty darn good. But um, so anyways, if you haven't done so, go ahead and hit that subscribe button. We're sitting at like 445, we're trying to get to 500. So hit that subscribe button and do yourself a favor and uh, ring that bell for notifications. That way you're notified each and every time a new video comes out because we put out a ton of content here on Bourbon Gloss. Um, feel free to leave a comment, ask a question, smash that like button, yo. That uh, helps the YouTube algorithms get it out to more people and stuff. So all those, th all those things are greatly appreciated. Uh, remember, stay hydrated, my friends. All right, so we're going to get into these. Uh, don't pay attention to what glass is behind what bottle or near or whatever. These are being completely rearranged uh, in no particular order using a very high tech, sophisticated, dangerous, proprietary method approved by NASA. <laughs> that's a bunch of bullshit, but that's one of those things I like saying that I made up. Bottom line is, I don't know what's in which glass, so we're just going to go through and nose and taste them and rank them. All right, so whiskey number one comes off, man, like sweet. I get apple, cinnamon, caramel, vanilla. Definitely get like apple, cinnamon. All right, let's go in for a taste. Cheers, Bourbon Quest. Yeah, apple, cinnamon, butterscotch. Yeah, apple, cinnamon, butterscotch. To be honest with you, a little weak. Might have to redo these. These might have been opened up a little long or something. All right, let's go into number two. Mm. So this one's got more like black pepper spice definitely get black pepper spice more cinnamon vanilla caramel comes off a little bit more on the proof on the nose on that one mm. yeah I get that I get like a little bit of dark chocolate oat barrel uh, Cherry, spice, vanilla, caramel. I think I like that one better than the first one. All right. I'm trying to go through these fairly quick. It's been a busy day. Mm. Definitely getting more spice on this. More vanilla, caramel really coming through. More of a oak and barrel char. Cheers, Bourbon Quest. Oh yeah, that's got a nice mouth feel. Definitely get that Kentucky hug. Um, get more uh, cherry, uh, barrel char, cinnamon, caramel. Much better hug than the first two. So that's really good. All right, a little water before the last one. Yeah, I get more cinnamon, vanilla, caramel. 
little bit more of a floral note on this. Definitely more floral than the other three. Cheers, Bourbon Quest. Mm, that's definitely floral, um, which is usually not a huge fan of, but it's it's cher cherry, caramel, vanilla, and then a little bit of floral on that bouquet of flowers. So I would rank them first, second, third, last. All right, we're gonna just reveal them. It's been opened up for a little bit. I think that may have done a little bit of difference there. Anyways, let's go ahead and see what we got here. So, <laughs> last place is your Weller 12. Probably out of these four, this is the one that would be the most allocated, uh, sought after, or whatever. It finishes last. Unbelievable. Then, uh, third place goes to D, which is Evan Williams. So it's between Jack and Elijah. How about that? So let's go ahead and see. Second place goes to. Yep. Goes to Jack. And your winner is, of course, Elijah Craig, 12 year old, barrel proof. These are all good. Like, so this particular one is A. 121 so from last year a 121 first place jack 10 second evan williams 12 and then that one so there you go that's that's the verdict on those ladies and gentlemen let me know what you think if you've had these um but they're all good uh, but i just think that just goes to show you when you're doing blind uh, you know the Weller finished last. I mean, it is a weeded bourbon, um, only 90 proof, so that kind of makes sense. But again, one that people hunt and chase after. Then you got uh, Evan Williams, 12 year old, 101 proof, and then Jack, uh, 97 proof, and then this particular batch of uh, Elijah Craig is 123.6 proof. So they kind of line up proof wise. I mean, obviously the higher proof one out, which is not surprising there. Um, these are fairly similar in proof 97 to 101, two years difference on the age stated. And then of course, you know, the lower proof uh, 90 on the uh, Weller. So there you have it. That's, that's the way I ranked them doing it blind here on Bourbon Quest. So let me know what you think. Leave a comment. Like I said, smash that like button, subscribe, uh, leave a comment. Thanks for tuning in. I uh, hope you find this uh, valuable, enjoyable. We'll do another video shortly. Uh, we just did Bottled and Bond, Age Stated. Um, and then next we're going to do uh, Barrel Proof. So may choose a different Elijah Craig than this one uh, to go into that competition. So that should be coming out soon. But all right, that's going to do it. Short, sweet, good run through, good bourbons. Uh, let me know what you think. And as I close, as always, Bourbon Quest, my wish for you is that all your Bourbon Quest dreams come true. Ha <laughs> ha! That's a wrap, yo. See you next time here on Bourbon Quest. That's why you want to ring that bell, yo. Bam!